In this video, you'll learn how to put out the different pages that we've been creating. Now, if we start at the back end of our store, our admin panel, we can click on the eye here to the right of online store. So this is what our shop looks like right now. And up here we have home, we have catalog, and we would like to add the contact us right here. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go back. And then we're going to click on online store this time. And then go down to navigation. And in here, you want to click on main menu. And then add menu item. So if we just click on this one, you can see that there's going to be different pages or different things we have been adding coming up. And in here we have the contact us. So we're just going to add the contact us and then go to link. Once again, just click here and you're going to get a bunch of different options. So we're going to click on pages and then we're going to click on contact us because it was a page that we created. And then click on add. So then we go to save. And if we return to our website and we update it, we can see that the contact us now appears here. And if we click on it, we'll be taken right to our beautiful contact us page that we created. So let's add the other things as well, the privacy policy, refund policy and terms of service. So let's go back and click on navigation once again. But this time we're going to go to the footer menu because you don't want these, although very important, also very boring uh, pages to be added on the top because they aren't the essentials. So we're going to add them to the bottom. So we're going to click on footer menu and all we have on the bottom right now is a search. We're going to click on add menu item and once again just click here and let's start off by adding the refund policy. And then we're going to click on link and remember it was a page we created so we're going to click on pages and then refund policy and then click on add and then let's do that again we click on the name here and now let's add the privacy policy and then link go to pages and go to privacy policy and add and then go to add menu once again last time terms of service click on link pages and terms of service and then add and now we're just going to click on save and if we now go to our website once again and scroll down we can see that there's currently nothing here but if we update our page we get the refund policy, the privacy policy and the terms of service. And if you click on any one of them, you'll be taken right to that page. So it's very simple to do this. You already know how to create these pages and now you know how to add them. If you want to change the position of them, that's very easy. It's all drag and drop. So let's say I want to put refund policy last. I'm just going to hold my mouse here and going to drag it to the bottom. And then I'm going to click on save, go back and then update here and they will have switched places. So it's very simple. Now you know how to do this. Now it's your turn to do this. So go ahead and go to online store, click on navigation and start off by adding your contact us page. Go to main menu and then click on add menu item, add the contact us and then do the same on the footer with the refund, privacy and terms of service. It's that simple. So good luck with this guys and see you in the next lecture.